everyone, hope you're all well. So today's video is gonna be a Christmas gift guide. I really love doing these. I think I've only done a few in the past and I thought that I would do one this year. And I know that there are quite a few beauty ones going around, but I thought I'd do a bit of a mix. There's a little bit of beauty and there's also a lot of lifestyle sorts of things and kind of things that I would love, love to receive and things that I would love to give to people. Also, it's Black Friday when this video is going up. So I thought that could work really well because there's so many discounts out online, like on Black Friday. So hopefully it can be really good time for you guys. So this first thing is something that I've mentioned before on my channel and I've been using it myself for months now. The Oral-B Genius 9000 electric toothbrush. This one's in rose gold. So this is more of a special edition one. I've got the kind of plainer one, which is also amazing. But this one, if you know someone who loves rose gold things and more like prettier things, it would be perfect. So you can connect the toothbrush up with your smartphone um, and it kind of guides you through brushing your teeth. I think it's one of those things, once you start doing it, you get really into it. <laughs> so anyway, I'll open it up so you guys can see. This is how it will look when you open it up. So it kind of comes very gift-like wrapped anyway. So I'll just attach the brush head so that you guys can see what it will look like. So it looks like this. It's so pretty. I feel like it actually goes really well with my background, like with all the gold hints and things. The reason I wanted to include it in my gift guide is because I think it's actually a really thoughtful gift. It's something that a lot of people wouldn't think to get for themselves. It's not something that someone's going to open and then forget about, you know, it's something that they're going to use all year and it's actually going to help them with their personal hygiene and just with their kind of beauty regime. So you can get this reduced at the moment because it's Black Friday. So I'll put a link down in the description box where you guys can go and find it. You, it's available at Boots as well. I think it's the perfect gift for beauty obsessives over Christmas because um, especially if you're really into personal hygiene and you like keeping up with it in a more high tech way. And also, this is so, I love this feature about it. It comes with a smart travel case. So you can put the brush in there and brush heads um, and the case charges your smartphone and the toothbrush as well. So it's just a really good kind of beauty travel essential, <laughs> like travel gift. Yeah, that's my first pick and it's something that I've honestly been really liking using since I've had my, my own one, so. <laughs> Yeah, also it would be handy to get them the toothpaste to go with it. Apologies for the lighting in this video. It's so dark outside today. It's like, it's raining and it's so dark and cloudy. So I've just had to kind of get my lights on and try to still do this video today. Okay, my next idea is something that is kind of like, you could either go out and find one or you could kind of DIY this. To some people it might be a weird idea, but I love it. Like if you, so if you love home decor and frames and everything, to find something that you know someone that you love or someone that you, or a friend or something, really loves or has loved since they've been small or something. In my case, it's Dumbo. I used to be obsessed with Dumbo. And we got this frames quite a few months ago now, but um, I just, I just have always thought it would be a really good gift to give someone as well. It's not something that someone would get bored of, it's something that will always be there. I think this would work especially well for family. A framed kind of artwork or something really personal to someone. It's just something kind of geeky, but I thought I'd include it. Okay, next I've got some books. I just feel like there are so many books out there at the moment that are more the coffee table kind of books and they're really, really visual. Obviously you can get someone an amazing novel that you know that they'll like or something, but there are just so many cool ones out at the moment. So these are two that I recently found in Urban Outfitters and I thought they were awesome. I really wanted to show them in this video. So this one, this one is called Bad Girls Throughout History. So if you're a bit, or if, whoever you're buying for is a bit like me and a bit like feminist and like woo girls, then I don't know, they might might love this. Like, I think it's just a really nice idea. So if you flick through, I think there's one page on each, just really kind of influential women throughout history or women that have done things to make a difference. Again, it's visual, it's not too hard to read, you can dip in and out of it. I'll, I'll link everything down below so you guys can get your hands in it if you want to. And then also I saw this book, which is so perfect for like <laughs> anyone that likes tattoos. Or if you know someone that really wants to get a tattoo and they're not sure what to get, or they're one of those people that are like, oh, I really want a meaning behind what I get and they don't want to get something for the sake of it. So if you fl flip through again, it has all these kind of sketches of tattoo ideas, has a bit about each design, which I would have loved a book like this when I was a bit younger and like, when I was first getting into them, it would have been so good. That was 15 pounds and it's also something that's really timeless. Like, okay, I'm going through all of these in a really random order, so <laughs> bear with me. My next thing is a Polaroid camera and I know these have been around for ages. This is my one, so I don't have it in the box and everything looking pretty, but the, you can find these in so many places now. They sell them on Amazon, Urban Outfitters. They're not cheap, but they're such an amazing gift and I think, 
I just, I don't know anyone, like no one I know wouldn't want to receive one of these. The only thing is that the film, the film for them is quite expensive. That's the only downside to these, but, um, and also when I was looking around in Urban Outfitters recently, I found this. It's Polaroid film, but it's black and white, which I've never seen before. So I thought I would just show that in this video as an idea because if you know someone with one of these, you could get them like funky film for it as well. It's another thing that they might not buy for themselves because it's quite pricey. And this was 12 pounds. So if they've got one of these, you could get them fun film or you could get them together. Like knitwear, I think is always really good to get because um, because of the time of year, like people are still wearing knitwear for a few months really, in the UK anyway. So this is just an example. This is a jumper that from um, H&M in a lovely color, lovely knit. It's something useful, it's something timeless. Um, and usually kind of the more simple you go the better unless you know that person really well and you know that they like really quirky designs or something then you can go mad but I think it's always it's always something nice to open on Christmas Day and it's something you could wear they could wear on the day you could check out my loungewear haul that I did as well last week for maybe a few ideas like massive cozy socks I love getting stuff like that as well so cozy stuff okay next I wasn't sure where to put this in in the video because it's, it's a really small thing it's more of like a stocking filler but I saw this <laughs> in Urban Out again in Urban Outfitters I just feel like they have loads of good gift stuff and it's little Tamagotchi and I haven't seen Tamagotchis for so long it's called Pixapet and it's just this really cute pink Tamagotchi and I really want to use this myself I've been like damn it I've got, still got to feature it in this video but it was £10 it's really nostalgic if you're a 90s a 90s kid <laughs> then you'll understand I wonder if there's people watching this that haven't heard of Tamagotchis let me know oh my god please comment down below if you don't know what a Tamagotchi is everyone used to be obsessed with them mine always used to die and poop everywhere the next thing is more of kind of a beauty homeware thing and it's diptyque candles. I couldn't do this video without mentioning diptyque candles because there's something that I am always so happy to receive and I always want to give people them as well because they're so beautiful. Um, these are two of the Christmas editions. I feel like candles are a really common thing to get people but there's so I think there's something that people always love. They're still really special to receive and they're also something that you don't always want to spend your own mon money on. Let me take it out so you guys, you guys can see what it looks like. It looks like this inside. Like it's so pretty. The last few bits I've got are more beauty kind of focused as well. First is a perfume but it's kind of like this brand of perfume and this is a little bit more expensive than a lot of the things in this video um, but it's Brado. Um, so they don't sell these in that many places. You can get them in, I think, um, Selfridges, Liberty in London. Obviously you can get them online as well. And they're such kind of like a blogger thing, but they are honest, I just, I love them so much. They come packaged so beautifully in like this white box and it's all like, mm. I got this as a gift as well. I think I got this for my birthday one year. Like your mum or your sister or your girlfriend, um, or your boyfriend. I'm sure they would love a Brado perfume. They're just, they're such beautiful scents. This is the Hollywood Icons DVD by Pixie Woo. And I really wanted to put this in because firstly the way it's packaged is, packaged is beautiful and it comes with a blush brush. It's a lovely little gift and it's obviously perfect for someone who loves beauty and or is interested in the history of beauty as well. I love watching Sam and Nick on YouTube anyway so. Also it's something that you could all sit around and watch over the Christmas period. So, thought I'd put that in there. Okay, second to last, I've got something for like, sorry, ugh, slightly younger girls. And I feel like there are loads of options for this. You could get a kind of like a makeup set from so many different brands. I'm sure there are tons out there. This one though really caught my eye because it's by Colourpop and it's a Hello Kitty set. And I don't know if you can see the front there, but it's so cute. And so you just open it up and it's perfect for someone who's quite maybe new to makeup or really loves playing with makeup and is a bit younger. There's blushes, eyeshadows, lip products. Even brands like Sleek, like recently their palettes and everything are really gorgeous and really good for makeup beginners. So yeah, kind of like beginner makeup gifts as well are really good. Okay, lastly, I've got a skincare focus sort of thing. So this is by Lizelle and this caught my eye so much because how beautiful is that packaging? I love it so much, I had to show it in this video. This is their really famous hot cloth cleanser. Looks like this when you open it up inside, it's this kind of, you know, special edition one. Sweet orange and clove, which is so nice for this time of year and it comes with muslin cloths. A cleansers are something that everyone needs, everyone would love to use a nice one and this is such a nice one to, 
to have. This would be such a nice gift, I think, for a mum as well. I feel like a lot of mums wouldn't spend a lot on themselves and on their skincare and things, so it's nice to just get it for them. That's my last thing. So that's it for my Christmas gift guide. I hope you guys liked this, found it helpful. I'll put everything that I've mentioned in the down bar. Um, hopefully I can find all of the things. If not, I'll put some alternatives down there. Oh, also check out my blog because I've got a Black Friday focused post on there as well with loads of discount codes and everything. So that'll be down there as well. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, don't forget to subscribe. You can follow me on Instagram, Snapchat and Twitter. And oh, I've changed my Twitter handle, by the way, in case some of you get confused. <laughs> so now it's just Samantha Maria. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.